Yo, what's up, Shackers? It's Super Life right here, and welcome to another Pokemon Mystery Dungeon Explorers of Sky Randomized episode. And today we are going to continue on with this game, and hopefully, uh, just, I don't know. Not sure if there's anything. Oh, we are running an errand. Oh, uh, cool. Oh, we're gonna ask them whether they're gonna stock perfect capital. Okay. Basically, what this one is going to do, and basically, what this uh, thing is trying to do is they want us to go to the Keckleon market and that's exactly why we're doing this so it's 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 just like a story plot thing it doesn't have anything to do with actually you know it doesn't really matter deliver a totter orb I don't even think I have totter orbs see I'm not sure I'm not gonna take that one but oh there's team razor one seat got me um I'm not gonna go to Beach Cave, so I'm not gonna take that one, but I'm gonna go ahead and take that Foggy Force one. Let's talk to Team Razor with you. We're considering going after a high ranking outlaw. We may just go for it. It would be a tough fight, but there's only one enemy. With all three of us on it, we can take on one outlaw. Yeah, that's totally true. The guild was away on an expedition. I heard. Oh, I love Zangoose. Like, Toxic Boost Zangoose, though? Pretty cool. Uh, don't remember. I don't think I got any new members, right? Um. Yeah, I don't think so. So, I'm. Oops. Alright, sorry, I accidentally pressed something. But yeah, I don't- we didn't get any new members, I believe, so I'm just not gonna go there. Um, I do want to check out the beach. You know, I wonder if we're actually allowed to go, like, on an expedition. Um, but just checking if there's a bottle here. I guess you can, so it doesn't really- wait, do we even have to run this errand? Or, I mean, of course, we'd have to eventually to move on the story, but can we just, like, leave? Wow, we can actually just leave. So I guess, I guess it's not that urgent. <laughs> All right. Oh, Burmy. Yeah, we're not going. All right. Um, what items do we have? All right, we can get a few things. I believe we're running out of space though. That kind of sucks. No money, right? Yeah, we never have money. Uh, here's team, uh, whatever it was, Slacker. Uh, I don't believe our egg's done yet. Yeah, it's, it's, there's no way. It's only been like a couple days, so yeah. We'll come back later and check out this thing. For now, we're gonna keep on going to Treasure Town in there. Yep, yeah, there we go, there's Dustnor. Yeah, so this is the reason why they want us to come here, but we'd come here anyways. Hello there. Oh, I forgot my Dustnor voice already. You are from the guild, if I'm not mistaken. Yep, we're Team Shackers. We work at the guild. Great to meet you. So what are you doing in this town, Dustin or sir? Shopping? No, no, simply enjoying your shots. I hailed him down, the great Dustin is very, so very famous. He started a conversation, and what a surprising talk. The great Dustin is so worldly and wise. I'm thoroughly impressed. Sounds like the rumors are true. Dustin so you really must be as smart as they say. May I ask Waterbrite what? Uh, may I ask Waterbrite what I can do for you? Have you come to shop? Oh yes, fine merchandise and fine wares. Sorry, nope. Well, we'll probably ask him anyways later, but... We're here to ask you something today, not shop. You see? Hmm, I see perfect apples. I'm sorry to disappoint you. We have no plans to stop perfect apples. Oh, okay, too bad. Chatdot's gonna be disappointed when he hears this. Here's this. Azuro, hurry! Wait for me! Oh. Hello to you both. Oh, hi, Kekleon brothers! And Team Shackers, too! What's up? What's the big rush? You know how we've been looking for our lost item? Lost item? You mean the same one that you were looking for before? Yes, an item called Water Flow. A Water Flow? Now that is quite the precious item. Yes, that's why we've been looking hard for it a long time. And then someone said they saw a Water Flow on the beach today. We're rushing to the beach now. Oh, it's dumb. It's dumb. They're plotting something. Yeah. That's awesome, it's great that it's finally turned up. Yes, yep. Come on, Azrael, let's go quick. Uh-oh. I was wondering how those little brothers were doing with their item search. Good for them, looks like they found it. I've never heard of a water float. What purpose does it serve? A water float is an item specifically for Uzzero. It can be obtained only by trading precious treasures again and again. As such, it is said to be an exceedingly rare item. Gosh, that's so! Our line of work is buying and selling, but we have never heard of it. It must be exceedingly rare. To sell such a rare item, I'm afraid such a day will never come. Krogunk, though. We have to report back to Chata. Let's race back to the guild. Oh, yep, okay. Let's go. What? They have no plans to stock perfect apples. Scrag! What am I supposed to do now? 
Um, we can maybe go get some perfect- oh gosh. Yeah. Yeah. Ah, uh, <laughs> slightly traumatic incident for Chetot. Okay. Well, we are gonna go do jobs um, for now. I can't remember, we actually have a pretty difficult dungeon, I guess, coming up, but not yet. I believe we do something today, and because um, Team Skull still has to plot, right? We have to let them plot, you know? We can't just we can't just go move on with the story without them. That would be totally unfair. Um, but we are gonna go ahead and open some boxes. Oh, I probably should get some items. Oh, there's Dustnor. Ah. So... Yeah, I probably need to sell some items? I don't know, we'll see. Yeah, she's out of space. Um... Yeah, that's quite unfortunate. What can I sell? Um... We got two focus blasts, I might want to keep those. Um, let's see. We have a pass scarf, do we even have a pass scarf? Uh, if not, I'm gonna store one in, because... We don't have a pass scarf. Okay, I'm gonna take out some heal seeds. We can always take it. Oh, we, can, we only have one space. Okay, that's fine. We'll store it. Oh, this is gonna take forever. It's okay. Pass scarf. Alright, what else? What else do we have? Let's see. Ample big apples. We'll keep these for now. Um. Yeah, we're keeping a lot of... Oh, we can sell those roosts. Yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and do that. We don't need so many roosts. Because I'm probably not gonna use those anyways, so let's go ahead and sell these roosts. 500. You know what? That's perfect. Let's go ahead and check, uh, get these, uh, boxes. Let's get these boxes, uh, opened, and it's great how in the newer games, like Super Mystery Dungeon, they actually, um, let you, once you get to a certain, oh, Nectar, dang it. We're gonna be getting a lot of Nectar, which is very fortunate, because I have that ability, which kind of sucks. Honey Gatherer, it really sucks, but we got a Wiggly here. Alright, but, yeah, so... I don't know what I want to take. We don't, probably don't need so many Black Gummies. Uh, or clear gummies. We definitely don't need so many clear gummies. And, uh, yeah, so I'm just gonna do a couple of this stuff. I done this stuff. But, um... Deep sea scale, U-turn, key, wiggly hair, yeah. Uh, what was I saying? Yeah, I'm glad that they, uh, added the option where you don't have to, um... You don't have to, uh, like, like, you're, you're allowed to have multiple... Like, you can get multiple uh, boxes of praise at the same time, which is very good. Um, glad that they introduced that. Oops, no, not that. Um, so yeah, we're gonna carry a whole bunch of these items in. And, um... Yeah, not sure how many I can actually store, it kinda sucks. Do I even have max elixirs? I don't even think I have max elixirs, which sucks. Nope, wrong one. Gotta see if this guy has some. Does um, I'm very tempted to get it. Uh, I think I'm gonna go get it. Uh, we don't need captivate, right? Because uh, I don't think we have that TM yet. And I'm never gonna use captivate anyway, so we'll just sell that. I believe I still have it in here. Yeah. And facade, I can't remember whether I already have one. Facade. No, I do not. She's out of storage space, though. Um, we're gonna go ahead and buy that Max Elixir. Because Max Elixirs are, uh... We're gonna need them, and we gotta start stocking up, since it doesn't seem like we're gonna be finding a lot of these, which kinda sucks. But, um... Uh, I I'm just gonna go like this, honestly. Um, let's see what job we're gonna take this time. Um... Uh, let's see... I don't want to take these uh, question marks yet, just simply because we uh, some of them might give eggs. So I'm gonna go ahead and take this Mount Horn one. I'm actually gonna go double check to check whether or not there's actually any other Mount Horn ones. Uh, let's store our money. Uh, so we're gonna have a lot of IQ boost this time. Um, unfortunately, none of them are actually gonna be good for the, our particular members, but that's okay. Let's go and check if there's any other Mount Horn jobs. Nope, not there. Not here either. Alright, so that's fine. We'll just go ahead and take one job. It's eight floors, so that's still pretty good, so. Go ahead and go out. 
already took the job, right? All right, yeah, we're gonna go ahead and go to Mount Horn, and yeah, see if we can recruit some more Pokemon. Look at that, we already got Bonsai. Uh, we're not gonna keep him, of course, uh, for now. We're just gonna use our current members for now, but yeah, nice, Bonsai. First Pokemon. Look at those TMs, though. And before I forget, I am actually gonna use these uh, gummies, so... Let's see if we can get any boosts in terms of IQ boosts. We got a Defense Raise, which is good. Ooh, wow, look at all those stats going up by one. It's good. Uh, clear. Let's see if, uh, Water Bike can get any, uh... Oh, wow. <laughs> it took him that long to use Shadow Sneak, honestly. Wow. Uh, yeah, Water Bike's not getting anything. It's alright, though, I mean, it's, it's just going off a tiny bit, uh, because it, it only works for super effective, or, like, same type. So, for example, Gold Gummies for Psychic types. Um, so, it's not gonna go up by that much, but that's okay. Alright, nobody got anything, but that's okay. Moving on. Alright, we found Cloister, and I love Cloister, of course, you guys know that. But we are going to go, and I guess leave it. Um, that's it. Uh, we, so we did get one Pokemon, which was the Bonsai. We got a ton of items, and we'll probably be able to sell them. We got a couple gummies, which is nice. Um, there's... We get a Reviver Seed. So we'll throw away an item, let's see. Eh, it's always the Heal Seeds. <laughs> but that's totally worth it, in my opinion. Oh, and there's dinner. Oh, hold on, everybody. Ahem, before we start dinner, there is something I must share with you. Hey, hey, hey! Come on out with it, let us eat already! Quiet, please! Ahem, now we just received word of this, another time gear was stolen. What? Another time gear? Another one got stolen! Uh, is it maybe the one in Fogbound Lake? No, it wasn't. The stolen time gear was not from Fogbound Lake. It is apparently from elsewhere. That's the second time gear to be stolen. It would be extremely bad if a third were to be taken. Now rest assured, ugh. now rest assured that I have full confidence in you all. But I must make one thing very clear: you must never tell anyone what you witnessed during our expedition. Understood? Of course. I don't have a big mouth. Uh, <laughs> yeah, yeah, totally, totally. Eek! I would never forget the promise we made to you. See? Okay, okay. Quiet, to everyone. Sorry to keep you waiting. Without further ado, on your marks, get set. Ciao. French, French, munch, 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 yeah, alright, awesome. So, uh, yeah, so we're gonna do a little talking scene first. We probably will get through two dungeons today, which is kind of cool. Um, so yeah. Alright, I just don't know. I don't know either, but when I was at Fogbound Lake and saw Time Gear for the first time, ooh. When I saw Time Gear, why did my heart start pounding so wildly? I must be reading too much into this. My pulse raced when I saw the time gear. And the time gear is being stolen? No, there's no connection at all. Hey, when I think about it, it feels as if the Fogbound Lake expedition happened a long time ago. Wasn't the view fantastic? Like a dream, even. I wonder how Yuxi's doing. I wonder if he's doing okay. See, Yuxi's actually genderless, so... Hmm. I knew it. I knew I shouldn't have trusted them. Soon after they left, another Pokemon would come. But this one, it stole the time gear. I should have done it. I should have taken their memories when I had the chance. I don't know exactly what you're talking about, but you're wrong. No one led me here. No one told me about this place. I've known about the presence of a time gear here for a long time. Ah, uh, I have no quarrel with you, but I am taking it with me. The third time gear. Ooh. Creepy. Yeah, alright. So now we wake up and I'm gonna go through one more dungeon. I'm um, not sure. We'll see, I guess. So yeah. 
Let's go out, and uh, he's gonna do a little announcement. Oh, I guess not. Okay. So, yeah. What? What's going on? Okay, got it. Hold on. You two, Team Shockers. Huh? What? Oh, gosh, what happened? What's up? You've got yourself some visitors. Visitors? They're waiting at the guild entrance. Go see them. Oh, interesting. Oh, right. These guys. Hey, hi. Huh, you little guys. We heard we have visitors. Are you our visitors? Yep, we wanted to ask Team Shockers for help. Help? Yep. We need your help finding a water float. A water float? You've been searching for your water float, right? Yep, someone said one was lying on the beach. We went there looking for it. We didn't find it. Instead, this is what we found. Oh, gosh. There's writing on it. Let's see, what does it say? The water float from the beach is now in our possession. Just try to take it from us. We'll wait in the deepest part of Ant Plains. But knowing how weak and puny you are, I bet you can't even reach us. Cha ha ha! Can't handle it? Go cry to your big shot friends. Cha ha ha! Hey, this note, it's a... It's a ransom note, isn't it? You, I don't even know if it's a ransom note, because... Does, 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 I'm not sure. I can't remember whether ransom notes had to be people or not. I don't know, anyways. You little guys shouldn't even think about going. It could be a trap. But the water flow is very important to us. We really want to get it back. But I can't take Uzzero to a dangerous place. I said I would go too. It's too much for you. I don't want you going into go, getting into any scary scrapes. I went to Ant Plains by myself. But many electric type Pokemon live there. I'm no match for them. I tried going many times, but I got I get knocked out right away. I just get, can't stand how weak I am. No problem. I know what to do. We'll go get Wigglytuff to do it. No, just oh man, this should totally be Wigglytuff. We'll go and get the water flow back for you. Really? You will. Yep. So no more crying. Okay, we're, we're sorry to bother you like this, thank you. You see your faces, all that crying and laughing. Come on, don't worry though. We'll get it back for you, sure thing. Let's go, onward. All right, so I guess this will be a little bit longer episode and we will do that. So yeah, that's interesting. I uh, better hurry up though. We might even, uh, during the editing, I might even do some other stuff. Um, you know, do some other stuff and um, like, like, in terms of editing. So, yeah. There's white and blue. There's a... Where's the blue gun? Oh, blue gun right there. All right. We don't need a blue gummy, then. Go for blue, because water bites blue gummy. Uh, I do want to check out my bonsai, though. Oh, I totally forgot Krogon exists now, right? All right. We might be able to swap... Kiss Charm. Team Charm, Sand, yeah. We'll have to come back later. Yeah, you know, once we get some more stuff to swap. We don't have a lot right now, because of all those Nectars. Alright, but I do want to take a look at Bonsai. Uh, where? Oh, right there. It's got Sniper and Scrappy. Interesting. Those are not bad abilities. Hyper Voice, Taunt, oh, Lava Plume. That's pretty cool. Um, of course, I'm perfectly happy with our team as it is right now, but Bonsai could be pretty cool. It's pretty interesting. Um, but I do want to keep our team as it is right now. So we're going to go and get ready. We're going to go to the beach again, of course, just to check it out. And uh, we're going to go ahead and take on Amp Plains today as best as we can. So as they mentioned before, there are a lot of electric types there. Um, so Water Bite may have a hard time. We'll see. Um, since the moves are all randomized... Wait, did I say there's a lot of water types there? No, there's a lot of... Oh, this guy needs help arresting Caterpie in Beach Cave. Really? 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 Alright then. But yeah, um, so there's a lot of Electro types, but it's probably gonna be easier because it's randomized, so that could be pretty interesting. I'm not sure. That could definitely be interesting, but, um, there's CG right there. Uh, I don't remember what we did not get. Yeah, okay, so. Oh, Golden Mask. But, yeah, we're gonna sell some stuff. Um, Gravelly Rock, I, I don't know. Let's know. We don't need Skill Swap, Will-O-Wisp. Yeah, that's, that's all I'm gonna sell. Max Elixir again, I'll take it. Um, what I'm actually gonna do is I'm gonna go and uh, use some of those prize tickets. Uh, I kinda wanna go through that and um, see what I can get from that. So yeah, 
Okay, so we can get a skateboard, Orenberry, prize ticket, and silver ticket. So I'm gonna go for the silver ticket. And uh, we're gonna go in and give up a ton of stuff. A lot of grass gummies. I don't think we're gonna need them, but I'll take them out later. Um, we'll just go for that. But we've got a good number of uh, Reviver Seeds now. Vanish Seed. Don't need Mix Elixir Loops. And that's all I want to give, but... Um... Probably don't need this Vanish Seed. So that's five, so that's six. Alright. Not now. Alright. We're gonna go for the prize ticket, and this time we are going to go with um, the last one in yellow. And let's see whether we win or not. Nope, it's not a win. Alright. Here's our consolation prize. Oh, we got a prize ticket. What the heck? Oh man, that's just like a downgrade, so eh. Whatever. It's fine. I'm just trying to get rid of storage space, you know? Alright, we didn't win either. Got a radar orb, alright, I'll take it. It's fine. Yeah. I'm gonna go ahead and take out a bunch of those grass gummies and actually use those. And I believe we can actually bring our team on this one, which is nice. Uh, for the Ant Flames thing, we can actually bring our team. So let's go ahead and uh, store some things. Yeah, we're gonna take out some of this grass stuff. We don't need so many, and I'll just give it to me or something. That way we can carry more, uh, just stick more stuff in there. Um, don't need that, don't need that. Dang it, not enough space. Probably don't need all these trapper orbs, they're pretty useless. And I'm just gonna sell those. Um, yeah, I'm gonna sell those and I'm gonna go ahead and store some, uh, different stuff. I believe we can actually store it. Do we not have gravel rocks? Guess we didn't have gravelly rocks. Oh, never mind. Yeah, there we go. And I'm gonna store a golden apple in there too. We don't need them. All right, now let's sell all the stuff, and then uh, we'll go ahead and head out to Ant Plains. Um, let's see. Iron radar orb, spurn orb, trapper orb. That's it. All right, 570. Take it. Okay. Let's keep going. Let's store items, and then we're gonna go to Ant Plains. So I'm kind of curious to see what's there, honestly. Um, because of course it's randomized, and that's just kind of awesome. So we'll go ahead and save, and we'll head out. Nope, that's not Ant Plains. Oh, there we go. Ooh, it's in the clouds. Nice. Oh, here we are. Oh, I love the music here. Okay. Let's go. Let's do this. Cool fables. I don't believe we get to recruit anybody right now. Um, so I don't know how. Oh my gosh. Be pouring on with Earth power. Yo, guys, we found the hidden stair, Secret Bazaar. Don't really need it right now, but... Um... And we also don't have money. Dang. That sucks. Um... We just don't have money, so we can't do anything, which really sucks. Maybe we should just keep, like, a little bit of money each time, but... That might be better. We'll see.
Oh my gosh, that monster house though. Would have been totally prepared, except um, Chuppa came in there first, which kind of sucks, so. Uh, we have zero reviver seeds, and we have no team members, so it wasn't as bad. Um, th that, that, that really sucked. Um, the, the Vaporeon's earth power just sort of sucked, but anyways. I see, that's what happened to your water flow. What a mean thing to do. Super Electivire's team is on the way there now, right? Yes. Yep, they said they would get, they said they would go get it for us. Good for you, we can rest easy knowing Team Shockers is on the case. Yes, that's true, they want to save Desiro too. We're so grateful for their help. Good day to you all, is something the matter? Hello, Dustmore, sir. We're look, we're talking about Meryl's lost item. Do you remember we discussed that very same thing here not long ago? Of course, I believe you're referring to the water float. I seem to recall you'd heard that it was on the beach. Exactly, exactly. But now there's more to the story. Ooh, gossip. <laughs> Alright, so... Yeah. One more thing. Where's Team Shockers going? He went to Ant Plains. Oh, gosh. Pardon, did you say Ant Plains? But in Ant Plains at this time of year, this is season four. No, this is ruinous. Team Shockers is in grave danger. What? I must leave for Ant Plains immediately. Well, thanks, Dustnor, for saving our butts. Let's go to the last part, Far Ant. What the heck even is this place? It's okay. Why is it sunny? That's weird. Okay, this is weird. I don't remember this even being a thing. I just used a Doom Scene and this guy is only level 12. Well, after the Doom Seed, but that's only like one, so these guys are very low leveled actually. Another move, another level bot. Oh, it's muddy water. Not too bad. Uh, I'm not gonna do it over Surf, of course, but that's not a bad move. It's pretty nice, and he actually gets water moves, which is nice. So, yeah. Okay, guys, we're at the amp clearing. And, yeah, there's lightning. I was there. I was there. <laughs> In the background, you don't see me, but I was there. Eric, this is a scary place. Wah! Ooh, it's incredible. It looks like lightning can strike this place anytime. We should get away from this place as harsh as... Er, we should get away from a place this harsh as fast as... Huh? Over there! Oh, what the... I guess that's what water floats look like. <laughs> is that the water float? Let's get a closer look. Uh-oh. Why did you come here? This is our territory. Someone's here! Hide! <laughs> it doesn't even fit us. Hee hee hee, so you're going to hide like that. That's kind of cute. Alright, we'd actually be grateful if you kept doing that. We'll sneak quietly to get as close as we can. Alright, let's take them out. Uh, no way! We'll be taken out if we stay here. Who are you? Come out! Ha ha ha, my name is Main Nectric. I am... I am the leader of these ele electro... What? Now prepare to fight. Dun -dun, dun -dun. What the? It's raining. That's not good. Um, I'm gonna get rid of his sacred fire right now. Just surf the whole entire time, honestly, for him. Alright. This is awesome. I should have gone for Wide Slash, but whatever. That's amazing. We just... That's amazing. We just honestly destroyed them. This is, this is insane, we're destroying these Electrike. Oh my gosh. See, I don't want him to run out of PP, so I gotta be careful. But, this is, in, this is insane. We are wrecking these guys. Zen Headbutt, that's, that's nice. Right, I'm gonna give him his moves back. This is insane. Just like, wreck this guy. <laughs> That rain definitely helped, because we were both very strong in the water. 
Oh, you dare. Wait, wait, we didn't come here to make claims on your territory. No, take this. Wah. Whoa. Stop. Stop, this is instant. Their words are sincere. They trespass, but they don't intend to make claims on your territory. T Dusknor. You, who are you? I am the explorer Dusknor. Maynectric, you have every right to be angry, especially in light of what your tribe has suffered on these grounds. Your hostility towards any that trespass here is natural. This place is your haven, a place where you find solace. I understand that completely. On behalf of these unwitting trespassers, I offer the sincerest apology. They entered here unbidden, but did so without malice. They mean no harm. We will leave you in peace as soon as our errand is complete. Please believe me. Maynectric. Hmm. You seem to know much about us, Dusknor. You make the claim that they mean no harm. So be it. I choose to believe your words. I will allow you some time. I expect you to be gone by our return. Ah, uh, Luxray. <laughs> yeah, I don't. I, I I don't understand why Luxray got this. Like why they're not there anymore. It's kind of weird. Anyways, a group of Maynectric and Electric. They are a nomadic tribe that always stays on the move. They roam in constant search of places that are hospitable to them. The ant plains is often lashed by thunderstorms this time of year. They find it to their liking, so they dwell in ant plains this time of year. But tragically, they were once attacked by enemies here without warning. They understand that they suffered terrible injuries. Ever since, Maynectric's group has been very sensitive about trespassers here. So if anyone trespassed upon these grounds, well, they would strike first for fear of being stricken. Somehow, at some point, that became a law among his group. Oh, I get it now. That's why they came after us. No wonder why they wouldn't listen to any of our arguments. Oh, I forgot something. I think the water float was over there. Ooh. It's here. Here it is. Dusknor, sir. Can you take a look at this? There's no mistaking it. Without a doubt, this is a water float. Really? We did it. Let's return the item to Meryl and his little brother. I wonder how this water float wound up here. I would imagine that it was put there deliberately. Whoever did this knew that you would eventually get to this spot. The fact that Maynectric protects its territory is well known. Someone expected a confrontation between you and Maynectric. You were set up. Wasn't that your intention, you sneaking scoundrels? Huh? It's about time that you came out of hiding and showed yourself. Jahaha, <laughs> so you knew all along. No point in hiding then. See, how do they put that there without Maynectric, like, hurting them? I don't know. Hey, it's you, thugs! Whoa ho ho! Yeah, <laughs> ha <laughs> So you guys did it, but why? Whoa ho ho, we were going to wait for you to get stumped by me, Nectric. Then we were going to step up, step in and mop up afterwards. Yeah, but we didn't count on this guy meddling. Shall we settle this? Ha ha, sure, if it was just Team Shaggers, you can bet that we'd rough him up good. But against the world famous Dusknor? That's a different story. Let's get out of boys. Yeah! Well. What, stinkers? I'm never. Oh, stinkers. Got that. I'm never forgiving those thugs. They certainly are quick when it comes to skedaddling. I'm afraid our effort would be wasted if we were to give chase now. I think we should deliver the water float to the young brothers. Yes. Awesome. So that's about it for this episode. Thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to leave a like, subscribe, and share with your friends after. No, before, and I will do this right now. Oh wow, we got our water float back. Yay, thank you, really. You saved other world way back in that when, and now this. I don't know how we could ever thank you. But really, thank you. Hey, that's all right. If you want to thank anyone, that's to thank the great Dusknor. If Dusknor hadn't been there, we wouldn't be here now. Thank you very much. Thank you, Dusknor, sir. No trouble at all. I'm very happy for you. It's wonderful that your water flow has come back to you. I must say, it is so like the great Dusknor to be so modest. And I must say that Team Shuckers has also been superb. After all, the team has again completed a difficult job. When rescuing Uzuro, you were so fast at pinpointing the child's whereabouts, and so fast at reaching your, reaching our young friend too. Oh, about the Uzuro rescue, we have to admit something. It'd be cool if it really happened the way Kekleon said, but that's not exactly the truth. We didn't pin down Uzuro's location before we rescued him. My partner here just happened to see it in a dream. Excuse me? A dream, you say? By dream, what do you mean? Oh right, maybe the Great Dustmore will know what it all means. You see, my partner occasionally gets dizzy spells when touching something or someone, and then my partner sees or hears events that happened in the past, or just about to happen in the future. What? Well, that's... that's the dimensional scream. Huh? What? Dustmore, sir, you really know about something like this? In that case, should we ask? Ask about what? Oh, right. About my own forgotten past. It's okay to ask, right? Dustmore, sir, there's something we'd like to get your advice on. Oh, and now we're at the beach. <laughs> okay. Yep, yeah, this is the spot. Then you regain consciousness. Okay, blah, blah. Oh, he was a human. I beg your pardon? <laughs> human? 
but our friend here seems to be a Pokemon in every obvious way. That's true. I guess this is even beyond the great Dustmore's understanding, but we're sure that something caused my partner's memory loss and caused the transformation from human to Pokemon. A human with a dimensional scream ability. You are... you said you're, you know your name at least. And that name would be... I'm Johnny. Ah, oh, I see, you're... you're Johnny! <laughs> nah, not really. Does that name ring a bell? No. It means nothing to me, unfortunately. Uh, what? Did I just see the faintest... Did Dustmore just hide the faintest of smiles? Or did I imagine that? I'm sincerely sorry I couldn't help you with that. However, I do know about the ability that Super Electivire possesses. Really, what is it? The ability to see the future or the past by touching something. That ability is known as the Dimensional Scream. Indeed, how such an ability is learned, that is unknown. But sounds and images slice across the boundaries of time, breaching objects and reaching into Pokémon to manifest as visions. And that is all that I know about the extraordinary ability. Ah, okay. So that's awesome. Well, perhaps this is why we became friends. To help unravel the secret of Super Electivire transformation into a Pokémon. I offer you my full cooperation. Oh, you will? Yes. To be perfectly candid, Eh, <laughs> totally. I can't stand knowing that there's something I don't know. Quite honestly, that is the full truth of it. Totally. Yeah. Alright. Oh, there's the Wingle. Oh, wait, no. Those are Pelipper? I don't know. Their shadows look like Wingles. My bad. I don't remember this this uh, cutscene, so... Huh, <sighs> okay. Hey! Hi, Bidoof. <laughs> I finally found you all! Y'all. Oh, jeez. I can't, I can't, I can't switch accents very well. What's the big rush? You're all out of breath. The call has been put out. All the apprentices are to report to the guild immediately. Oh no, something is up. I will go with you. Hurry, everyone. So, I don't know how to say that in a southern accent, sorry. Southern accent. Um, this is getting to be a long episode, so we're just gonna keep going. I got a tiny bit more time. Um, I guess I'll save it for next time? Yeah, I guess I'll save it for next time. Anyways, thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to leave a like, subscribe, share with your friends, and comment down below. If you're excited, stay tuned, I guess. Um, the next episode will be, of course, being uploaded later. So thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to... Uh, uh, why do I feel like I always, I always say that like six million times? But anyways, guys, thank you guys so much for watching. And don't forget to... Yep, just kidding. All right. But anyways, guys, thank you guys so much for watching. And see you guys later.